All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of the Subscriber Dynasty. Playing in our bowl game this week, we're playing in the Sugar Bowl. And this is actually a live commentary. I typically don't do these for the Subscriber Dynasty. Um, for one, that way I can I can have a video playing or have talk to my wife or something like that. It's a lot easier. But um, C Morg MM asked if I could do a live commentary for this game. So here you go, live commentary. Let's jump right into it. All right, looking at some of the stats, they are not too bad. Uh, they've only lost one game in the Big 12, which was to West Virginia, um, old, old Zaccardi. So they weren't too bad. So hopefully we can get the win. We've played more games than they have. Oh, because we had the... <laughs> well, I'm 9-1. I don't know. Somehow, they've only played 12. We played 13. But they don't have, I guess... I'm confused. Never mind. But we, we're doing all right offensively. We just suck bad against the pass so hopefully they don't throw the ball a whole lot i think to come out stop them our top players is not going to show my seniors but doll <laughs> he's not a senior anyways i think he's a sophomore with my free safety wide receiver wiggins next year we're going to be stacked dude they got henderson tolbert and powers let's jump into this game okay now if they play like the italian it's going to be rough because he knows how to beat me but i'm hoping they don't you know what i'm going to be a linebacker the whole time this game was why not? That Italian guy recruited this team pretty good. He built them up a long time, man. We were, what, in our seventh season of this reset? And uh, and he had them for all but, like, last year and this year, so five years. That's pretty good. Okay, we start off every game with the same play, triple option. We try to run it. If they don't give me the option, like right here, I'm going to run it anyways, but I'll typically audible out of this one. See what they do. Oh, you're going to let the quarterback run? Man, you must not know who Dahl is. This, this Rory guy is pretty good, man. I'm just saying. He obviously didn't see all of his highlights during the season. Oh, heard with a spin move. Now, this is going to follow my offline dynasty where I'm like, hey, I'm not going to try to run the option as much. Freaking the first series, nothing but read option, triple option. Whoop. Oh, I was going to try to spin around. And Dahl didn't have the spin move, though. I know a couple of you guys were like, what, why were you trying to throw so much in the conference championship? Why, like, why, what for? Now, we started off 100% in that game until the interception, I'm pretty sure, or right before it. We were moving the ball well. We were throwing the ball well. It just made the one mistake. It was a solid game. Uh, nothing nothing really to it other than that. Just a great performance by both of us. Who the heck is McCauley and what is he doing on the field? I don't recruit you to drop passes. I don't even know who, who was that guy. McCauley Culkin or something? I don't know why he was on my field. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, my receiver tight ends, when he went to go get that guy and did not get him. He can say all kinds of stuff. And, don't, and the other thing about me doing a live commentary with this, oh, is you get to see my play calls. Typically I hide that, so you got to guess, see what I call, but now you can actually get to watch it. We take the lead seven to nothing, and I'm actually really looking forward to next year. I know my offense, I'm getting practically everybody back. I mean, if I lose Hurd, Cruz is coming back, my quarterback's coming back. I got a pretty stacked receiving core. I wasn't the, the linebacker on that one. That's my bad. Kaplan is straight fast, though. Holy crap, man. One play up the gut. 75 yards later, touchdown. We went from about the 40-yard line down to the 11. Huge penalty. I can't believe that, man. They just straight up ran up the middle. Like, no big deal. Oh, good blocking out there, receiver. I appreciate it. But as I was saying before they scored in one play, my, my offense is going to be legit next year. Defense, I'm not I'm not 100% on. Quarterback's faster than the defensive end. I'm sorry. It is literally not possible. <laughs> Unless that dude's got 99 speed, it is not possible. I'm sorry. Because my quarterback is one of the fastest people in the game right now. But I'm getting a lot of my offense coming back. My line's going to improve because they're actually pretty young. Because uh, they're garbage this year, if you hadn't noticed all season long. They've been straight booty. Haven't had time much time to throw it. We're losing a couple of receivers. Maybe McCutcheon. I think Temple's a young guy. Well, maybe Wiggins isn't going anywhere. Wow, that was a dangerous pass. Temple with a spin move. Get wrecked 21. Where you at? I mean, making the play after the fact, but where you at? It's typically, they'll hit a couple of big runs, hence the 75-yard run. But <laughs> our example, 75-yard run. But it's, it's, it's more of a, a rarity than a, like an everyday occurrence. And I said rarity. Isn't rarity one of the My Little Pony Ponies? Friendship is Magic, Pony. I, I don't know. I don't watch the show, but that sounds familiar. You work so hard. I didn't work that hard. Oh, crap. Oh. Dang. That, <laughs> wow. I want that guy on my team. 
Marcus Powers, zeesh. I've never had somebody come off their zone so fast. Whatever he was in, whatever it was main or zone, his play recognition must be through the roof. I have never seen that happen. And that's that was insane, dude. He came off instantly. As soon as I started running, he was gone. I'm sorry, you're not going to challenge me to find a hole in the defense. I'll find the hole in the defense. I want to hit Temple. I don't think he's going to be open over there. No! I went to hit RB and I hit A. Luckily, that wasn't picked. At least we get some points out of it. All right, let's see if we can not give up a gigantic run again, please. Pretty please. You know, I'm going to pinch the line. I'll let him try to beat me to the outside. I don't think that would happen. Up the middle is going to happen a lot. We're still sticking. Wow, we're still ticking. Sticking to our cover two man. That's what we always run, dude. Why switch it up now? Oh, I'm going. Oh, I was coming on the blitz. Good play. Good play. Yeah, that was a much better series defensively. <laughs> they didn't score. That's always a good sign, right? Ta -da. Oh, no, he stopped. Just keep running. Uh, I hit him too late. Let's see if we can't hit some big plays right here. Oh, I saw you, A. Lawrence. He was pretty big at the start of the season, then I moved Temple up. They haven't got a first down because they scored on one play. Oh, A, I wasn't even looking at anybody. A was so open downfield. Gosh, man. I just watched that happen. McCauley, who are you? Oh, yeah. Good play, McCutcheon. 44 had no idea what was going on. Madden, you tap it. Yo, he'll, he'll freaking tap it. He'll lob that ball way up there. Is it a play? Not going to happen. There's more guys in the backfield than I have on my offensive line. Man, I just hit over two field goals. I don't think I've kicked two field goals in a game in who knows how long. That same play again. This time it's Oliver. We're bringing a blitz this time. Dangerous. Dangerous, especially whenever they did me dirty a while ago. Come on, Williams. Get over there. Get closer. Lewis. Oh, I tried jumping. They got the first down just in case they were going over the middle. And gas straight up wrecking my face. Gosh. Made me look bad. Oh, quarterback scrambling. I have you stop the quarterback scramble. That's a, that's an option I have set game. No, I didn't want to blitz everybody. Oh, got him as he threw it. And got the first down again. They're just they're just driving now. Apparently, they figured out my defense. If they if they score a touchdown, they got the lead, which is not acceptable. Lewis, go for the big hit. Got it. You got to be kidding me, man. We just we just got them to false start and then they got us to jump for the encroachment that sucked three yards to go way too much time to throw they get the first down suck man very much so not happy bringing a fat blitz still no pressure he drops a for sure touchdown oh we need another stop if we can hold them to a field goal too we'll be okay we just need the stop man no way. No way. It was three of us there. Good play, Lewis. We got fortunate they didn't score a touchdown there. We're only up by three. We should be up 20, 21 to, 30, to to 10 right now. I'll give them 10. I don't think they should have 10, but should be up by a lot more what we are. I'm, I'm, I'm glad <laughs> that, that my offensive line is going to improve next year because they are straight booty this year, man. Garbage. Because this time, Temple's going to be open. They went with an A. This time, Temple's open. It's like, I know it might take you a couple of steps to get going, but your acceleration, McCutcheon, is absolute booty. I'm just like Mr. Complainer Pants this game. Any day now. Whoa! Power. Of course it's Powers. Who else on their team is going to be good at anything? All right, looking at the stats, we're, we're beating them pretty good. They got 161 yards of offense. We got 200 and... 13. So we're doing pretty good time of possession. We just had the one turnover and somehow we're only winning by three. We need to get that ball in the end zone. No stupid turnovers and just put the game away once and for all. Had a potential for a really good return. Um, my lead blocker just ran right by the, out, the outside edge gunner, man. Just like straight up ran right around them. It's like, I know what you guys are capable of. Freaking play to your potential, man. We should be up by more than three points. Make it happen. Make it happen. I'm holding my joystick to run up the middle. So whenever I get the ball and I'm running towards the sideline, I'm confused by what the heck's transpiring. And I go nowhere. Don't tell me it's a setup play and it not be set up. That irritates the heck out of me. All right, Wiggins, I'm putting you and Lawrence on a definite go route there. Wiggins, that's why I put you on a go route, baby. 
You're not quite fast enough to go off and leave him, but you absolutely beat him off the line. Look at that. Just whoops. Thank you. Please don't make me settle for another field goal because I'm going to be pissed. We should be up 28 to 10 right now. Not 28 to field goal. Out of way. Good moves, doll. Good moves, Rory. Trying to get another jump. Is that hot? No luck. Oh, oh man. You had a good block there, 64. Push him out of the way, and then you stopped. 15 plays on this series. And we're still two yards short. Almost didn't get in. Almost didn't get in. I wanted to give that to Hurd, but he was tired. So Cruz comes in, gets the, gets the touchdown, go up by 10. All right, put him in the spy. Back to Weber. Let, let, let him run back to the middle of the field where all my safeties are. That's fine. Not 15 yards later. That's, that's BS, but got to stop him. We're going to try it again. Another blitz right up the gut. Oh, get to the... What? What in the world just happened? Why did my guy not get the tackle there? What was all that nonsense about? He's like, stop. He's like, okay. Wow. This is the, the great series that we needed. A stop on this series? No. You have a touchdown on like seven plays? That works too. They are bound and determined to not go away and to infuriate me in this game. <laughs> it's like we've, we have like really good series. Like all game long, and then they have one, maybe two series where they are impossible to stop. That's interesting. One year lineman don't block anybody. I got him, got my catching before that guy came back. This is the downside of running hurry up. <laughs> I've had the ball for like two minutes, but I've ran a ton of plays. So I got him stuck. Apparently he wasn't stuck. Is that hot? Try getting the jump, no luck. Counter play actually worked out pretty good. Cruz is in, my speed guy. Give me that first down. And then I, I gotta come out and throw it, right? I mean, that makes perfect sense. Moving the ball awesomely, but running it. Oh, I hit McCutcheon on a great pass play, actually. Never mind. I assume 69 would come out. Like half of my offensive line came out. Oh, we're tired, me. We need some water. It's like we've been running this no huddle offense all season long. It's nothing new, it's nothing special. We've been doing all year long. Is that hot? No luck. I should have hit A. Should have hit A. Oh, well, we get your feet down, King. I still hit you anyways, baby. I saw you downfield. Got to keep my eyes up. Mixing up the different zones, the different blitzes. Pretty much whatever we want to do. Wide open. How did he get open so fast? That play was like instantly, man. Just put my arm back and the guy's going to stop doing what he's supposed to be doing. Not even bother making a tackle. Wow. And it's still not over yet. That's even more wow. I was about to say, the better not say he gained yards on that. That was a sack all the way. Now, as bad as it sounds, their running back just got hurt. That was like the greatest news that we could have right now. <laughs> no. Oh, it's a draw. Not going anywhere. Is that a quarterback draw? Sure as heck was. Fourth down. They got to go for it, right? I'm not going to come out and immediately throw it like I typically do in these situations. Ooh, got him in quarters. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. He's going to run that ball now. No huddle that. With as much as he was getting sacked, to him almost have another 100 yards, I have 100 yards, is crazy. Because he got blowed up all game. Blowed up. Not blew up. Blowed up all game long. What the heck's wrong with you, man? We're trying to keep the clock running. I uh, don't like that guy way out there. That's going to make the handoff a lot easier. Oh, no. Good block, 87. Crew's doing some work. Yeah, hang your head down in shame, cowboy. Third and three. We, we get it. Powers. Powers is shut down the whole second half. I noticed that he was a big threat. Wow. Guys, wow. Because I'm, I'm, I'm afraid of trying to cover 15 with Lewis. You're not throwing it to him. We'll get the sack, though. I had a way defensive line. What's the running back doing? It's a draw play. Oh, just ran over him. Henderson, the backup, comes in and run over fools. Fourth and 15. That seals a deal. Give me the ball back so I can kneel it and get it over with. I'm blitzing. I'm blitzing right here. Oh. Wide open. Picked it. Oh, stepped out of bounds. That's even better. I want to score again. Go for it on fourth down your own 20 yard line. Down by 13. I want to score again. I'm pretty sure Hurd's got a, a, a... No? He doesn't have a touchdown yet. I'll need to give him a touchdown if all possible. Oh, why? Hurd, need to give him a touchdown if all possible. What the spin move? 
The diving effort was so sad, man. I heard with the moves, baby. Yes, sir. That was that was embarrassing for that guy. He was like, no, as he dove. Watch, watch this, watch this guy. He's like, I got him. Ball game. We win 37-17. Sugar Bowl champs. Very happy with how we performed in the second half. First half, not so much. Didn't get in the end zone enough for my liking. But a win's a win, right? That's what I like to see. Go into a bowl game, get you know, the victory, beat a top 10 team. They're not a top 10 team, are they? I thought I was like 13 there or 14. That's not a top 10 team game. Oh, man, that spin move was straight dirty. Absolutely dirty. <laughs> that poor guy's going to be remembered for that for the rest of his career. That's, that's right. More. Now, Powers, Powers was a beast, man. That dude, if he doesn't go pro, I won't be extremely surprised. That guy was legit. And I remember the Italian with that guy. Player of the game, my quarterback, 20 for 29, 213, three touchdowns, 21 carries, 70 yards. Had a pretty good day. Pretty good day. As we get the trophy, I'm pretty happy. Pretty happy. Don't want to check the games around the country, any of the stats like that. Let's go ahead and check out and see how everybody else did. All right, just got done showing the highlights from the game. I hope you guys did enjoy that live commentary. Like I said before I started, I typically don't do that um, just because it makes the video a lot longer. And as much as I like to show off my gameplay, the online dynasty isn't just all about me, man. There are there are 11 other guys in the dynasty. So um, I like to have my gameplay longer to show some showcase some good stuff. But at the same time, I also want to showcase the guys as much as possible because uh, without y'all, I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be doing this. So. I, that's why I do it. But if you guys did like it, let me know. I might do like special occasions every now and then <laughs> to have some happen. Typically, I only do it whenever I don't have time to go back and edit and then voice over. Um, it's kind of a rarity, but it is it is what it is. Let's check out and see what everybody else did this week. Um, North Carolina ends up winning 28 to 10. He he is putting up his his gameplay over on YouTube, so make sure you go check that out if you want to see how that game played out. Um, typically. Uh, that's actually like a low scoring game for both teams so i'm anxious to see how that game played out merc does live stream user games he was having some issues um and by the time i saw it like i was not available to watch it live so uh, make sure you go check out his channel links in the description as always if you want to see the louisville game he played the italian over at tennessee so make sure you go check out that game um i just saw it you definitely want to go check it out <laughs> you definitely want to go check it out he was telling me about it the other night and uh Looking forward to seeing that game because the way the way he described it sounded awesome. So make sure you go check out his video link for him. The Italian is also down in the description. West Virginia wins 58-28, 53-28, sorry. Missouri ends up losing 34-7. Michigan State wins, lost, sorry, 28-10. Southern Miss lost 21-14. Man, a lot of losses this year, but we also had a lot of user games. Mid-Tennessee State loses 17-11. Stanford wins 34-7. LSU wins 42-32, Florida wins 48-30, and like I said, you want to see the Italian score, go check that out. I'm pretty sure Stanford only had one loss this season, and it was by one point to West Virginia to start the season. So, <laughs> um, I'm, I'm going to schedule them again next year. I'm just letting you know now. They will be scheduled again, because he has provided, in the short time he's been in, he's provided old, uh, West Virginia the toughest contest, so... I'm anxious to see if he could pull it out now that he kind of has a feel for his team because he had just joined a Stanford. He was Boise State last the year before, so um, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see how that plays out. Anxious, anxious. <laughs> but we're gonna advance it real quick. See how everybody ended, overall ranking and all that at the end of the year, and we'll be right back. All right, let's get done with the advance. We're to the end of the season. Everybody has played their games. Let's check out the top 25. I will go into a separate video. The next video, since we're, we're going we're gonna to be in the off season, it's going to go through all Americans, Heisman winner, um, and, and award winners and all that. So we can get a breakdown as well as stats. Cause I know some of you guys like to look at all that, but checking out the top 25 to end the season. This is where everybody ended up ranking North Carolina two, Florida three, Stanford five, LSU, Michigan state, Arizona state. So was that seven out of the 12 in the top 10? Seven out of 12 in the top 10. That's pretty daggum good. Um, Missouri at number 12. Uh, Louisville 21. Mid-Tennessee State 25. So was that seven, eight, nine, 10? 10 of the 12 in the top 25 to end the season. Uh, with Tennessee really close. And 
thought there was another. Another one. Maybe not. No, there's gotta be another one. There's three there. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, there's gotta be another one. Oh, it's uh, so they're missed. My bad. So they're missed. Just, just missed it. Um, let's actually see where he ended up ranking. If Casey didn't know, you can go to Championship Contenders and see what the ranking is. So me projected, I'm projected to be pretty daggum good next couple of years. Number one, number one, and number two. But the current rank for the current year, you can just sort it, and it'll show you where everybody is ranked. And this is essentially the top 25, and then some. So if you ever want to know where you're at and you're not in the top 25, you can just come in here, sort it, and see. So Tennessee, number 32, not too bad. So they miss. Um, top 75, 76. So close, <laughs> so close. But that's a, that's where we're sitting, man. Looking forward to this off season, like I said before in the last video after this next season so after the season of 2020 we are doing a full-on reset like completely wiping the slate clean starting again with the exception of people in the dynasty the more than likely i would assume everybody stays in if for some reason somebody can't go in um i'm going to go next on the wait list the waiting list is always linked in the description so if you ever want to know where you're at or if you want to be added to it just let me know hey i want to be added to the waiting list and you can go check it out. I think it's currently at almost 200 people, um, which it's it's kind of it kind of sucks because we only have a, like 10 spots because myself and the Italian both record. So that's one that's one and two of the 12. So we only have 10 open slots. And some of these guys have been in this thing for a long time, man. And I'm not going to punish them. I'm not going to kick anybody out. Um, and if I were for sure to know that the servers weren't ever going to get shut down i would pay the 15 dollars that you need to have multiple dynasty saves but i'm just not 100 percent on that so i, I don't want to i don't want to waste the money you know what i mean to to get another dynasty rolling plus i just really don't have the time i'm working a full-time job and recently got married this past year so um i got, I got other priorities man <laughs> this isn't a full-time job for me this is a part-time uh just for fun man i put a lot of time into this like my brother asked he was like well how much do you make and i was like I, it's all right man it's not not anything <laughs> out of the ordinary like i make more in a day at my job than i do in a month doing youtube and he's like well how much time do you put into it <laughs> like i put into it probably like a part-time job man and it, but it's a blast i thoroughly enjoy it if i could if i could do this every day of the week i would because it's fun to me you guys you guys make it a blast but that's just that's just the way that goes, man. <laughs> just the way it goes. But we are done season seven of this reset. We've done 12 seasons total of this subscriber dynasty, man. Uh, we're going to do one more with this, this rule set, and then we're going to switch it up. Um, but we're looking forward to year 2020. I'm going to force everybody to stay with their team in the offseason, so we should get right back into the next season within about a week. So this is going to go up on a Friday. On Monday, we're going to have the off-season, or the stats, end-of-season stats and all that. And I'm hoping by the following Friday, we'll be set up again and have the next season already rolling. If not, then it should be should be by Monday. But I am going to be out of town this weekend, so that's going to delay us a little bit. But it is what it is, man. <laughs> it's just, just the way it goes. But I want to thank everybody that's been in the Dynasty. Thank you guys for getting your games in in a hurry and getting them played and communicating with each other and getting them done. It's been a great season. Um, I would have liked to have fared better, but it is what it is, man. When you got a lot of guys in here that are pretty good, um, that's just the way it goes. You can't win them all. <laughs> as much as you would like, you can't win them all. Unless you're West Virginia, then you're undefeated out of, what, three years? But he's getting close. We're getting closer, man. We're getting closer. But that's going to be it for this episode and this season. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all next time.